Uh, forgive the mess. Had I known that this was Inquisition Day, I'd have tidied. A woman's in a wheelchair. And you think that I put her there? The man you should talk to is Dr. Gerald Tolman. This isn't about a rogue doctor. This was a cover-up. You put the integrity of this hospital... The word I'm thinking about isn't integrity. It's litigation. Cases like this get hospitals shuttered. So as I only have a few minutes before I have to address our board, let me get ahead of the 5,000 lawyers who'll be coming for your scalp by asking one question. What the hell were you thinking? Are you smiling, Peter? I'm sorry, I was trying to dredge up my ashamed face, but it just wouldn't come. Maybe you'd like to visit Elizabeth's recovery room. Okay. I'll put aside my peek at your moralizing and just focus on New Amsterdam. You're worried about lawsuits. So if I had gone after Tolman's license, not only would he have sued, He'd have won. Clint Hartman was ready to testify. And who do you think a jury would have believed? Hmm? Gerald Tallman, chair of neurosurgery with a list of accolades longer than your arm, or his 28-year-old intern, Clint? So your answer was to do nothing? Oh, no, my answer is pulling him from rotation and getting him the hell out of the hospital and making sure that he doesn't hurt anyone else. No lawsuits, no headlines. The only trace is the grief for Elizabeth Archer, which, by the way, I share. And the knowledge that because of my choices, New Amsterdam has a neurosurgery department for you two to screw up. You should have gone to the board. Dilettantes? Billionaires? They were your employers. And not a doctor among the bunch. Do you know any of these doctors, Madam Brantley? Do you? The doctors who, if all this came out, would have lost their jobs, their professions? I protected them. I take care of my own, and that is my legacy. And man, I am proud of it. Your legacy is a profound error in judgment, which I can relate to as I made one myself when I didn't fire your ass sooner. Wrong end of the Goodwin High Horse. Oh, how I missed it. I looked up to you. I know. As a leader, the only question worth asking is if the cost of protecting New Amsterdam is your conscience, will you pay? And if the answer is no, you're not the leader you think you are. St. Francis in Philadelphia, Rose Hill in Portland, County Children's in Chicago, all hospitals Tolman has worked at since he crippled Elizabeth Archer. It makes you wonder why he moves around so much, doesn't it? it makes you wonder how many more Elizabeth Archers are there. We do what we have to to survive. You do. I'm going to make sure that man never lifts another scalpel. Max. Leaders make choices that keep them up at night. And if you're sleeping well, you're not doing your job. <laughs>